Okay, so I'm being manic, and it's late at night, and I'm connecting dots that may or may not be there, and you can tell me what your reaction is, but I have to tell you I never believed Speaker John Boehner's bravado on the House floor, because he is an establishment GOP rhino who is supported by the Chamber of Commerce, and how is it that McConnell is, is now planning a clean bill to finance the Department of Homeland Security, which was used to stop Obama's executive amnesty? So I'm thinking, you know, maybe late one night, Mitch and John were sitting around with some Chamber of Commerce cronies, and Mitch told John, hey, look, you know, go ahead, this defunding bill that you're doing, it'll never pass the Senate. So talk as tough as you want. Placate people in red states. When it fails in the Senate, Mitch says, I'm going to come along with, with a, you know, another hurried up bill to save us all from French Islamic radicals, because let's not let a crisis go to waste, and, and, and we'll be able to show everybody how patriotic we are, despite you know, Obama being a tyrant and a king, we're going to look good, and that's all that really matters in politics, isn't it? What would be the harm in actually holding DHS hostage until Obama relented? Because what have they done anyway to prevent Islamic terrorism? They have released uh, Gitmo detainees. They can't even name our enemy. They are Muslim murderers. The Chamber of Commerce is the establishment GOP. That's all you need to remember. And rhino Republicans like Jeff Denham in California, in the House, are working as hard as they can to keep illegal immigration flowing into our country. All along, the puppet GOP congressional leaders are keeping the illegal immigration flowing no matter what, no matter what the trickery. Illegal immigration will, will keep flowing just like the red wine and Kentucky bourbon John and Mitch are drinking late at night, conspiring against the American people.